everybody, I'm Marissa the Art Chief, and thank you so much for checking out today's video and a Merry Christmas! Yay! Today I am actually doing a mini speed paint. This will be the first of free art related videos uh, that are Christmas themed. I also have one ever video that will hopefully be coming out later today. That is not dependent on me, that is dependent on my brother as it is a collab with his channel but I don't know about that. But for now, I am doing this video. And what is it that I am doing? I am doing some Christmas artwork of my original series, Revolution of Full Color, featuring the main characters, Masato Yushoko, Go, and V. Yes, those are strange names, or code names. Anyway, uh, if you wanna know more about Revolution of Full Color, you can click the playlist that will be suggested. That will be the chapters. But anyway, uh, I drew Masato last year for Christmas, just in a fun chibi, along with her cat, Sumi who's also featured in this drawing. And uh, yeah, that was cute, but I actually want to do a full illustration for Revolution Full Color as I had more time. And I never actually did anything for Revolution in Full Color uh, <clears throat> that it was uh, the characters all together outside of one picture. And I wanted to draw all of the revolutionists, but I didn't got time for that. So I just had to draw Masato and the two uh, main ones. So I'm calling this Winter was the revolutionist. Now, if you notice the beginning, I actually was drawing Masato in a different winter outfit, but then I changed it. That's because this has kind of become a classic winter outfit. It's, um, I'm gonna say this several times this, uh, time because I realized I said it in all recordings, but, uh, her outfit's actually based off of Miyuki from the movie Tokyo Godfather by the late, great Satoshi Kon. And, um, really fun movie. And I like, uh, the little uh, ensemble of clothing that Miyuki gathered, um, and I figured I would do it for Masato as well. It was very, very hard to figure out the colors because since Masato's bangs are, uh, cyan, yellow, and magenta, it really does limit on um, what colors I can use for her that won't look weird. Anyway, for, um, V, I just drew her in a simple winter coat with a winter skirt. Masato doesn't wear skirts, she hates skirts, so I drew her in a short. But for V, I drew her in, um, a winter, um, coat with a blue plaid skirt and some earmuffs, and I gotta say, it looks really, really cute. I really am proud of V's design, and so far I've had actually a really good, easy going on actually drawing her. And I'm glad because her hair is a little bit different than what I usually draw. I don't usually draw uh, braids like that. So um, it's uh, very nice to kind of outsource my um, talents. Wait, is outsource the right word? Uh, it's early morning. I got that early morning braid. I can't think. <laughs> expand, expand my uh, drawing capabilities and do, try something that I don't usually do. And it's nice to know that I'm actually good at it. Anyway, for Go. Uh, yeah, I, more, when I describe his hairstyle, honestly, it is very kind of silly. You got this kind of wavy part, not wavy, spiky part all on one side, and then you got, like, just the front quarter shaved, and then there's, like, braids overlapping it. It's weird. It doesn't make sense. And it probably wouldn't even fit for his character to wear, but nonetheless, here we are, because I thought it would be cool. And when you describe it, it sounds super lame, and it probably is, but uh, nonetheless, I like it. It's just gonna be the style. Don't question it, bro. <laughs> for the background, I had a lot of fun with this. I actually think I did a really good job. I was looking at illustrations uh, from the artist Hentai. Uh, uh, hen... Uh, there's no way I can say that that won't sound like the ever word. <laughs> it's not a hentai artist, folks. I swear. <laughs> They're a very beautiful illustrator, though. You should check out their drawings. And I love the style, so I was kind of mimicking their style for this drawing. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> and it was, it was fun. I drew the scarf, um, pink, I mean magenta, not pink, it's not pink, it's magenta, or fuchsia, I don't know, I don't really want to care. Uh, anyway, I drew it magenta, and then I drew, um, the shirt, undershirt, underneath the turtleneck sweater, blue, I'm gonna change that later on, uh, because I realized that I like it better the other way. And for V, I just put her in, like, completely white clothing, 
white and blue clothing. That's really the color scheme I want to stick to was her. And then for um, Go, I just pretty much did him was black, but having like a green under turtleneck and then um, like green tint to like his pants and stuff. And like I said, I'm really proud of this drawing. And I drew it very vaguely-esque winter because I also want to use this for just my phone wallpaper after Christmas so that way I can easily remove some of the Christmas elements. Uh, because I really do like this and I really am proud of it. <clears throat> and um, I think if I was going to say I wish I would have changed anything is a uh, ghost pose could probably need a little bit of work. I'm not good at these up. I'm not good at these dramatic angles, but like I said, go out of your comfort zone, try something new, blah, 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 blah. And, um, if you're wondering where Sumi is, I actually realized that I forgot him because I called this drawing Meowy Christmas. <laughs> Winter was the revolutionist. And, um, uh, I realized that, uh, if there needs to be the cat, if it's going to be Meowy Christmas, it can't just be Misato here. No one will get it. Yes, Misato likes cats, but she doesn't have anything cat themed. She's not wearing her cat hoodie here. So I need it. I need Sumi. Misato's loyal partner. I actually wanted to draw Misato's ever partner, who does appear in chapter one. His name is XR. However, it's also a code name. However, um, I wanted to keep his design. Well, I mean, his design's already known. His reference sheet is out. But I wanted to not draw him in an illustration quite yet. So, because of that, I decided to just do these two. Plus, I, I guess I like these two. And I do wish I could have actually put the rest of the revolutionist um, in this drawing. But like I said, I was running out of time. I was running out of time. I, I started this year so much in advance and ahead of things. And then slowly it devolved. And I didn't even get to do any Christmas fan art this year. Usually I do like gifts. And then one personal drawing. And then one Christmas fan art. And unless I can somehow miraculously whip something up pronto, which I highly, highly doubt it, uh, that it, it ain't happening. But I actually do have something else planned. I won't say what it is, so that way if I fail, no one will know. Outside of the fact that I said I was going to do something and you'll never see what it is. But yeah, like I said, I've got um, two ever art related videos coming out and then one ever video and like I said that will be collab with my brother and by collab I just mean that uh, we will both be releasing the same video only it will be edited in my style on my channel and edited on his style on his channel I don't recommend seeing his channel's version because it'll probably give you a mass headache because he's got a unique editing style <laughs> Uh, the biggest problem is these um, Clip Studio paint speed paints. Uh, they're very cool. And it's a very nice feature, but uh, it is harder to see what is going on sometimes because sometimes it just looks like I've stopped, but I haven't. It's just that it's small, so you can't see it, and so that's annoying. But um, it is a uh, little fun. It is very fun to do, and I didn't have time to do a full speed paint because I had everything to do, and it is a lot more easier just using this. Because it's like, oh, did I turn on the speed fan? It's like, oh, I know, I don't have to because it's already recording. Yeah. So, yeah, it's a very, it's a very fun feature. I remember when I saw it, I was blown away because I was like, I can close it up and it still records? Oh. Okay, now, so now I'm just adding some snow because it needs to look a little bit more wintry. Always plan to do that. Always. From the beginning. I didn't add it in this last bit. No, I, I think I did plan on doing like some kind of snow, but I just didn't get quite around to it. Anyway, here we are adding Sumi. If you're wondering why you didn't see the drawing process of Sumi, it's because I already had the line art out for him for a reference sheet, so I just copied and pasted it and I was too lazy. Uh, and then I added a little Santa hat, so that way it would be a little bit more Christmassy. I'm going to take off the Santa hat, though, for the winter version. And um, yeah, there you have it. That was the drawing. I hope you enjoyed. Stay tuned. I've got some Ever stuff planned. Uh, and, uh, hopefully it will go well, uh, and, uh, Merry Christmas to all who celebrate, and if you don't celebrate, then I hope you have a wonderful time, and still enjoy this wonderful time of the year. It can be over-commercialized, and a whole bunch of everything, but it can also be a very, very nice time. So, I hope you enjoy. See you real soon! Bye!